to thank all you guys for subscribing to my channel and for hitting me up. Don't forget to click like when you like this video. Um, today I'm just doing a video uh, topic based on somebody asked me a question. Um, could I still be friends with my ex? What do I recommend and how should I approach it? So I'll bring this to the table for you guys. Listen, don't forget you can do response videos to my videos if you like what I talk about. And, you know, inbox me and ask me your questions too. Let me get right into it. First of all, I always say this. An ex is an ex for a reason. You hear what I just say? Say it after me. An ex is an ex for a reason. And I believe that if an ex is in your past, you got to know why. Okay? You got to know why. Now, you got to know how you live your life. You got to know exactly what you want from your life. Because some people will be acquaintances and some people are coming to your life for a season. Some just come temporary. I'm going to be honest with you. You see, us men, we know that we want you for backup plan. We, we like to, we, 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 they say many men think with their penises. That's the truth sometimes. But I'm going to tell you this, right? When a man, if a man speaks up with a woman and we want you on the, on, uh, uh, and we have another woman already and we're still talking to you and we're still trying to be um, flirtatious with you and we still calling you after 12 uh, or certain stuff like that obviously we still want to have have you as a backup plan you know that's that's what it is so I'm gonna tell you I'm gonna give you four, four things that I think you it'll be good for you to do if you want your ex to be where he's supposed to be one they can't call you the same time so that's the first thing you have, you have to have rules on the times that they can call you and cannot call, call you. So what's rule number one? I call this one 9 to 9. Okay, between 9 and 9, they can call you. Okay, between 9 to 9, they can call you. That's, that's, that's what I say, right? They can ask you things between 9 to 9. Before 9 is too early, okay, you still be in bed or still relaxing. They can't call you when they feel like. And when they call you... They only can call you to talk about certain things. They can't ask you personal questions and what's going on in your life because they 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 they, they forfeit that right. They forfeit that right. So they can't be asking you, "Oh, what did you do last night? Where did you go last night? Who did you hang out with?" No, no, no. It's about what do you want or how was your day and what's the weather like. And you keep it simple and to the point. Rule number two: They can't turn up to your house when they like. They can't knock on your door when they like. They can't come and tell you at 3 o'clock in the afternoon and just turn up just like that. No! You're not there. You don't come to my house like that. They have to know exactly what and when they can come to your house and when you tell them to. As a matter of fact, I wouldn't even see them on a personal or regular basis. When you see them, you see them in public places. You see them where everybody can see you. They don't come around hanging around their house just like that. An ex is an ex for a reason. Rule number three. <laughs> This one's a bit controversial, right? But I'm gonna tell you this. It's about how they see themselves with you. They can't just come and tell you what and what not to do, or who and who they think you should be with. No, it don't work like that. It don't work like that. It don't, it don't work like that. No, no, no. You choose who you have in your life. And some people come in your life for a season. So whosoever you have in, they can't tell you. They can't tell you that. And that's one of the very important key elements you got to remember. And that's that's my three rules I'm going to bring for you. I'm going to forget about the fourth one for now. But I'm going to tell you this. Okay? An ex is an ex for a reason. If you can, you want to ask me, can you keep friends with them? Yes, you can. But they have to know their boundaries. They have to know what they can and can't do. They forfeit the right when they were your boyfriend or girlfriend. Okay? And I will say this to all you sisters out there. All you sisters that have been broken hearted and had this guy trading along for two or three years. Let go of that baggage. Let go of that baggage. Let him go. Not coming around giving you a little booty call now and then. Nah. Let him go. If you don't have a clear cut then you don't know exactly what you want. You understand? You never become back to your whole self. You keep carrying that baggage, tagging it along. And for all you men out there, listen, I'm going to tell you this. A woman that's broke your heart, a woman that's messed up, a woman that forfeit her right to be your partner and you're still going tapping out now and then when you feel like, you ain't never going to be your whole self. You can never move on. 
Anyway, it's your boy Dr. G. You just tuned into another Dr. G show. Listen, don't forget, subscribe to your channel, to this channel, to my channel, <laughs> and just click like on this video. I'm gone. Front on it, but what I say, as I say.